As some of you may know, I am here for a while in New York City and this medicine cabinet I am so happy with right now. I thought I'd show you a couple of things that I threw into my bag right before I left and things I forgot. But I try and do like little containers of things, especially if I'm going to be somewhere for a long haul. Think about what I like to use you know, for months on end. And so one of the things, of course, I forgot is my Trini AHA cleanser. But I'm lucky Michael's bringing it next week, so yay. In the meantime, I went to Sephora and I picked up this Tatcha Soft Cream Cleanser, the purple one, the rice cleanser. It comes with this little purple moisturizer, which is in my other bag. But this, I thought at first, oh gosh, it's gritty, which means it's going to like hurt my skin barrier. And then I looked it up online and it's perfectly safe to use every day. And I love, I love her, this Tasha cleanser. I have discovered Super Smile, okay? So it's not cheap, okay? It's pricey, but I use the tiniest pea size amount of this whitener and this accelerator on a dry toothbrush. That's the key. Like I always brush my teeth and I wet my toothbrush first, and then I put the toothpaste on. I've been doing that for 57 years, so it's kind of like, I'll take my toothbrush, I'll put it under the water in it, and then I'll be shit, and I'll wipe it off with a towel before I start using this. You sort of gargle for 30 seconds first with the whitening pre-rinse, and then you use these. For anyone who can't do the teeth whitening, I can't do it, it's excruciating. So this works for me as well as strips on occasion. Oh, why pray tell am I wearing terry cloth tennis sweatbands on my wrist? So I wanted to actually make these cuter and maybe one day I will. I call them my wrist rockers. What they are, a friend came over to the house one day and she brought me a little present and there were sweatbands in, wrist sweatbands in the bag. And I said, love, I don't play tennis, like what? She's like, no, 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 this is gonna change your life. Wear them when you're washing your face and brushing your teeth in the morning and you will not get like wet and soap dripping down your arms. The sweatbands will catch them. Wait, what? So yeah, I put them on. I can't believe it. It has changed my life. I don't have to change out of my pajamas or my bathrobes after I do my stuff every day. Crazy. The best. What else do we have here? Oh, okay, so we have the Unseen Sunscreen for the neck and decollete. I always use that there. I use the Unseen Sunscreen in this area because I never really know what I'm gonna put on. So I, I don't wanna get tinted sunscreen on my uh, clothes. I mean, always buildable blur. I love it. It has a little bit more coverage. Lately, size slip tint, say. I've been actually mushing them together because the Thrive has a 40 SPF and the slip tint, has, slip tint has a 35 SPF. 35 freaks me out a little bit. I find it a little too, a little too weak. Maybe that's just me being neurotic, so I don't know. If you have brown spots, Skin Suticles Discoloration Defense. You know, it's an extra step, but if you tend to get brown spots, I tend to get them, especially here in the cheeks and down into the jawline. Particularly, I've loved it. It really works for me. Augustina Bader face oil, essential. Just love it, you know, whenever I'm feeling parched. I like it under makeup, I like it in the mornings. I love an oil. So when I was a kid, my grandmother would smear olive oil on my face. She thought it was the best moisturizer ever. Fortuna Skin, this blue one, full of olive oil. It's amazing. It's very regenerative. I love that. And I mix it with my prescription Altrina, which my dermatologist was yelling at me because I've never used retinol. So she got me started on this, a pea size of this Altrina. It's the only retinol or trantonin that I've ever been able to take, but I have to take it with this Fortuna. So I do a sandwich. I do the blue Fortuna first, let it sit for 20 minutes, a pea-sized drop of the retinol, and then another uh, little drop of the Fortuna just to like let it sink in. And my skin can actually now use retinol. If you have allergies, I find these essential. This Ocu Soft Plus, they're these little pads. I have a whole box here because I'm staying for a while. These little pads of cleanser. You just clean your lids off every morning and then a little sustain complete. And I find that it keeps my eyes less itchy, less irritated. Good stuff. I've got my Nutrafol, 
here. I have forgotten that I brought it. I should really start using it. For the hair area, I take the pills every day. Has saved these little bald spots on the sides. My living proof, my volumizer, and my Flex hairspray essential. Oh, this, this, this philosophy, ultimate miracle worker uh, body serum. It's light and it's moisturizing, but I feel like it's also doing a little bit of resurfacing. I've been battling the hair lately because you never know, especially with curly hair ladies. Anybody who has curly hair knows, depending on which climate you enter, your hair takes on a length of its own. So I, I didn't know how it would react in New York. And I've got to tell you, it's reacted beautifully. I'm so proud of her. I should actually probably name her because she's a separate entity than myself. Uh, but here, because there's less humidity so far than Dallas, I do not need as strong products. So I have been doing this concoction of, I, I have them in different little bottles, but it's Color Wow. Color Wow Flow Etri for curly hair. I do a dime. I do a dime of the Color Etri, it's in a different bottle. When I finish a little travel size bottle, I'm always, that I like, and that doesn't leak, I wash it out because you'll never find, you cannot find a good travel bottle anymore that you can purchase. Anyone? And then I can't. So what I do is when I find one that I like and I know is not going to leak, I then wash it out when I'm finished the product. I put a little piece of blue painter's tape on it with the new product in there so I know what the hell is inside it. And then when I finish it and I want to put something else in there, the blue painter's tape comes right off and I can rewrite my stuff in there. Genius. So uh, where, where, I digress, where was I going? Oh yeah, okay. So right now for the curly hair, I'm doing the Curl Wow flow etri dime size maybe just a little less of this and then curl shook that i spray in it's sort of like a topper gel to the other one so this one's not enough on its own for me so i have to do the both together and then lastly just to wrap it up when you get a zit on the road it's like and you don't have anything i like renee rouleau this is a night treatment it's daytime for me i know you can't tell but whatever she does it works i wasn't supposed to shake it you're not, it says clearly don't shake, it's white. And you take a little bit of product on a Q-tip or something, let it sit there and it just dries up the zit. Look, it's not pretty, it's for nighttime, it's daytime now, but I'm gonna let it sit here and have a cup of coffee and then just gently wipe it off and maybe it'll do something. But she always comes with me, just in case. And I mean, and that's basically it. The other stuff is just kind of this sort of ivy stuff mished in. And anyway, that's it, that's the medicine cabinet. I need to go and get a new eye makeup remover, so we're going to Sephora.